Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. You're watching Nails by Magenta. So today is a small video about my salon. So it's like a guided tour, inside my drawers, what you'll find. Um, and yeah, just a little bit about my workspace. So here is the outside. Um, it was built in January, so it's literally still very new um and was built within seven days at the end of the video there's some before pictures actually so you'll be able to see kind of like the process of it um so a little quick glimpse of the inside of my salon um i wanted it like quite girly because you know it's a feminine area um so first we're going to start with my pedicure area i use the balava pedicure bowl system absolutely love this it is so hygienic um you've got a temperature setting which keeps the water to the temperature that you apply it in you've also got vibrations you've got single liners that you change for every single client so it is the most hygienic system that i could get um this is my pedicure trolley so I've got all my foot files and replacement rasps, blue disinfectant soak, um, and also the orange foot scrub. They all come from Hollywood Nail Supply. Check them out. Uh, tools, moisturizer, nail brush remover, cotton pads, toe dividers. They are all on that little trolley. Um, so then I use this little round stool to sit on when I'm doing the pedicures. Um, got a couple of little quotes on the wall. And then we are gonna take a seat in my client chair. Um, so my desk is Ikea, the drawers are the Alex, and the top is the Limman. Uh, these are my gel polishes from this side. We've got gel polish from the gel bottle ink. Um, then I've got like all my nail art designs that I've been slowly adding on to during lockdown actually. I've been doing like these little online masterclasses and I've loved it. Uh, pigments, acrylic colours, which are from CJP. Um, I've got like a real mixture of clients. Like I have some that have acrylic, some that have gel, some that have both. Uh, petite nails armrest, love that. This little dish is for my clients' jewellery. If they want to take it off, they can pop it there. It's safe. Um, Lotus Biscoff biscuits, because everyone needs those. So that's the front. We're going to go around to the back now. Um, so I have on my table my dust extractor, which is just a cheap one from online. Uh, my Sayen K35 e-file. Um, my essentials, which is my palettes, prep spray, base coats, top coats, dust brush, navy pro tools in their little pouch, and the um, disinfecting cleaning system. Um, I have the Halo desk lamp, which is the white one, and then the IKEA grey one, which I use mainly just for photographs. Um, so my top drawer is throat sweets over at the back because I suffer really bad with my throat nowadays so they're over the back for when I need them cash as well I've got e-file bits files buffers soak off clips lint free wipes um dappen dishes second drawer is acrylic powders so it's all my core powders at the front and coloured at the back they're like little drawer dividers from Ikea as well they're really good gel polishes in that drawer then this drawer is gloves masks forms and my junk drawer at the bottom we've all got one of those so over to here these are little display stands i got from tmbl online i really like these actually they've got like a weird material like clean film in them but they work really well Card machine, Nova Pro Tools water bottle, uh, a little picture and an orchid. 
Okay, so these drawers. So the top one is got all crystals first. So they're all the Swarovski crystals. The other crystals that are in this basket are from Hollywood Nail Supply. Um, their crystals are incredible. Like they are on par. If so, maybe even better than Swarovski. But yeah, check them out. Uh, acrylic paints, gel paints. Over the back there, I've got a basket which has got things like Stick It, uh, Crystal Katana, Kira Sky Base, um, which I use for the crystals, um, little triangle trays, and then some like random embellishments. So you've got things like flowers, micro beads, jewelry pieces. Um, like a mixture of silver and gold studs in different shapes and then like a chameleon kind of jewellery set as well then this one is all my pigments so some of these I've had for absolutely years they are from Glitterati nails um, and they're like chameleon pigments, chrome pigments they're flakes, There's there's just a mixture of all sorts in there Next drawer down is my glitter drawer. So this colour wheel I got from Nail Chemi. Oh my goodness, what a lifesaver this can be. Like, I'm not very good with mixing colours. So for me, this massively helps. So like if you've got someone who wants a, a glitter mix or you're trying to make a colour for something that you're painting, it's perfect. Random pad that I clearly don't use. Um, so these glitters are a real mixture really, the pots um, all sit on Ikea spice rack trays I believe, they're spice racks, I think they're like spice trays, something like that. So you've got Tracy Lou glitters, um, you've got Glitter Planet glitters, glitters that I've just collected over the years that I've put into these little pots, um, the middle ones are all that sparkles, um, you've got random bits like that in there, like little stars which come from Glitterati. So the, the ones in the middle, the, all that glitters ones, love those, their, their glitters are just so pretty, like they're sparkly, they're just lovely. Um, next down we've got my tips, which again, Hollywood Now Supply for natural and clear. Um, we've got decals, stickers, stars, stripes, all sorts of bits in there. Um, I've only really just started kind of getting into stickers. Um, but yeah, I'm still kind of learning from those, playing around with them. But I love them. Um, one of those like little magnet things that you can put your tips on when you're doing nails, stamping, sharpies, next drawer is, okay right so this is all excess tools um, before I went on to Navy Pro Tools, I still use my old tools for peddy and stuff like that, spare rings and pop sticks in that one, this is like a really random drawer, so like you know you get these things that you have, you don't know why you buy them but you buy them just because you think I love that. Why Why do I need this? What am I ever going to do with those? No idea, but I love them. So I bought them. So that's like randoms draw. This one is all my seasonal nail art. So things like Christmas, Halloween, the kind of things that I don't have out all the time. So I just keep them in there and then when it comes to that season, we're coming up to it, they come back out for display. Uh, next one, this is in a cutlery organiser insert. Love this, this is really handy. So, dotting tools, silicone tools, sanding burns, wires for my computer, the screwdriver thing for the ring doorbell, um, glasses, because I have spare glasses. These are all nail art brushes and gel brushes that I use. So, my favourite brush is this one. So it's a daisy nail design um, fine liner I guess, it's just such a good brush, like it honestly, it's, it's a good all rounder, like I love it for everything, 
that you can get from Hollywood Now Suppliers as well. At the back is just a couple of invoices that need to be filed in my accounts. So this is a navy drawer, so it's got all my disinfectant and detergents in, my little stockpile. Um, and then also my foils, which I colour coordinated the other day. And I'm so pleased with it, like it's so satisfying to look at it now. And when I want a colour, I know exactly where to go. So that's what lockdown's here for, hey? Um, right, so clipboard, GDPR and data handling, patch test consent forms, and the black folder is where I store all of those client details. Cotton pads, soak off bowls, uh, <laughs> floor wipes, uh, toe dividers, and a random basket of, well, random things, as you can see. Bottom drawer is my overspill, so it's like extra wax, extra spatulas, extra bits and bobs, they all just go in there. So heading over to my desk again, to the cupboard, um, we have all of my acrylic liquids, so we've got the 1, 1 1.2, the ultra adhesive, Cuticle softener, love this. This is from TMBL. It's the best cuticle softener I've ever used. Bit of lip gloss, why not? We've got uh, alcohol and acetone over the back there as well. Bottles of those that I decant into my pump bottles. Um, nail files, cotton balls, kitchen roll. This is uh, refills for my natural tips. I mainly use natural tips. I don't really use clear tips that much, so... I've always got like a backlog of those. Uh, bill pads, tripod for recording. Um, that's pretty much it in that cupboard really. Yeah, that's it. So we're now moving over to my kind of like drinks area. So we've got the kettle up the top there. We've then got some coffee syrups, some more biscuits over the back there ready to put out, price lists um, in the top there, then at the bottom in the basket is all of my wax melts, so I love a good wax melt, especially the Ava May ones, they go in there, um, it just smells nice, like I love going into a room and it smells good, like it's, it's satisfying, so this is all my drinks kind of stuff, so you've got Teas, coffees, oh, couple of bottles of champagne. Okay, so I got married recently, and I honestly, my clients have been so lovely. So I've just got loads left over. So I thought I'd keep a couple of bottles there just in case. You never know. Um, cleaning products also at the bottom. The end cupboard is my waste, like from the water, the water waste cupboard. So I won't bother showing you that because it's not very interesting. Um, this is my waxing trolley, so I use warm and hot wax, then I've got tinting, spatula strips, lashes and lash lift at the bottom. That grey box holds all my towels, um, so all the clean towels are in there ready to put out. Couch, mirror and then we're kind of like back to the start really. So this is where my... Um, Google is, Google plays my music, does my time telling, whatever else, next appointment cards, um, and yeah, that's, that's pretty much it really, so that's my little salon, um, feel free to ask any questions, um, so these are a couple of before pictures for you to see kind of like the progress of the salon, um, yeah, feel free to ask any questions, and make sure you like and subscribe my videos and my channel and i will see you all soon bye